Starting to go. Here we go. Carve it up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Not as much swing as we're normally used to here at the Highland, but I do believe that Darren and the Ice Boys maybe were putting more ice in their drinks last night, so that tends <laughs> to happen. See, play in the outside one. I'd maybe take a run at the top guy there to clear things out, but uh, hey, if you make it, who cares? Mr. Man. Man's throwing control weight here. He's gotten a little outside. We might be in danger of a flash here, guys. That flash brought to you by Richardson Lighting, the best lighting in the industry. <laughs> Okay, so Dallin here, they don't got last rock, so let's see what this magician's got cooked up for us here. It looks like he's going to try and wrap another one around their top button and really put the heat on the boys. He just threw it, so I gotta think that he's gonna be pretty darn close on this one here. Slid a little deep. Gotta go a little bit, a little tight here. Yeah, without playing the one on the center line there, that leaves you the danger if things don't get made. And now Team Myers looks to really put the gas pedal down and put the boys in some heat. We're in one here. This is right where his roots are. A nice little draw game, a little soft touch for old D Myers. He knows this in and out. Smooth as butter. Is he just going short here, AJ? Or? Oh, yeah. Just tuck a piece, and yeah, that's pretty darn good. Try and make this double, roll away, and leave yourself a chance at the forefoot on your last one. Boys haven't helped out the skipper a whole whole bunch in N1, but hopefully King Henry's got some answers here. I gotta think he can't miss with 
He's sliding with a hammer, which I haven't seen one of those since about 97. So that's, he ain't kidding around. It's close. Give her, buddy. Oh, that's just tough luck. You throw it pretty darn close and end up kissing the top one, and all three stay in play. Now Dallin has a chance to throw one top four here, buried, and and he's throwing it a four-piece chicken nugget meal in his last one. Give this one to the sweepers, let them work a little bit, and let them put her where, the, where she needs to go. Coming up short, not a bad result because uh, yeah he's still he's got a little back in here if line's good but uh, yeah if the weight's not good oof, you don't want to give up the four the four ball on n1 I've been there and it usually ends up upstairs by n4 so The boys are on it. The line's good. It's all about the weight here. Uh-oh. Four times for blue, it looks like. We asked Saskatchewan what they know about 5G. Uh, more speed, more innovation. It's gonna make our lives a whole heck of a lot easier. This is what 5G looks like. Better, faster. Sounds like one more G, sounds pretty good. I don't know what it means. All you really need to know is the future of 5G is here and will continue improving through investments in network technology. or the logo. Our events are always painted houses, but in the future coming out, I'm pretty sure we're going to be going to all logo houses. Uh, they're a great revenue source for any curling club. You can get your advertisements on there. And usually after the first year, the houses are paid for it, so free money for you. So hopefully check, it, check Jet Ice out for your future in-house logo.
Oh, wow. Hey, I say you look good, play good, right? Corner guard, she's up a little tight, but it'll do the job for sure. Dallin's wasted no time. Coming around that, that center, trying to set up the end the same way they did the last and keep on rolling. Like a glove. <laughs> they don't call him no miss Mickish for nothing. I don't know. Pin to win. All right, let's see if we can come down and freeze one on the top here and turn this into a checkers match. It's a little hot early. We might get lucky with a bump here. Yeah, stay close, boys. You want to get by that guard. I don't think we did. Ay. Oh, you know. Actually, the weight was pretty good, too. Jeez. Big man with the soft touch. Very nice. And yeah. what I can only imagine is the strongest Achilles in the game of sports. <laughs> Great flow, too. Like what he's doing out there. Uh oh. This Maybe looks a little wide. Uh, they're trying to get her to move, but he might have gas. Oh, oh man. See, sometimes this happens, you know, you get a little bit more of a lead than you expect and kind of lose some mental focus, a little bit of that sharpness. This might have been the opportunity that Henry was looking for here. A little bit of a break. See, he's going the opposite way here. I kind of like going the same way as he just, they just threw it there. And I'm not sure exactly how much this one's going to curl on the other side of the sheet, but... Hey, if King, King Henry likes it, I like it. You don't mess with the king. Never. Is it me, or is, do they look like they're a little heavy coming out of the hack? And they, but they ha they end up okay, but it just looks like they're coming out like steam and beaming. Looks very heavy. But we got to get it by. That's not ideal. Yeah. Almost pushed it far enough to guard the yellow, though. So there's a little bit of a positive to take out of that guy. You know, I feel like some of the calls from Team Henry are just a little unorthodox, and they're kind of making Dallin think more than he normally would. Yeah, a little suspect. Yeah, if he can get close to nose here and tap that one out, uh, yeah, Blue will be sitting pretty good here again. You always love the chance to throw the same shot. When you miss the first one, you want that redemption shot, and this is what Jordan's got. But then you sometimes miss it twice, and then a broom gets broken. We're talking about you, Brennan Jones. <laughs> There textbook, it is. absolutely textbook. The key there was his weight being perfect there. He didn't overthrow that thing, gave it a chance to come up. You overthrow that guy and it was Jam City. Speaking of Jonesy, that was my junior team, me, Jonesy, and Dallin, the boys. You guys didn't play with a fourth? <laughs> we only needed three. Actually, I'm just kidding. Mitch Critton was a hell of a junior player, too, with us. 
That's a good squad. Don't I don't want to get started on it though, because it'll last way too long and lend in tears. <laughs> Come on, boys. God, jeez, we're just getting on the wrong side of ticking these guards. I'm not gonna lie, that was a ton of ice given too, so I don't know if he pinched it inside or just not enough weight. I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, it looked like it was a little light, but yeah, he might have just came over top a little bit on the release there. Springer I love that both teams just keep committing to their own side. Yeah, let's do it. Once you know it, why change it? There's really no way that Garrett can throw this wrong. Garrett Springer, the only player on this team to have a banner hanging in the rafters of the Highland Curling Club. 2019 Mixed Doubles Provincial Champion, champion with his wife. Ooh, look at that. That's crafty. You know, that's what happens when you're already ahead. You get those lucky breaks. You get a little bit of the wiki ticky love. It's that banner waving things over. Okay, this is a big shot here for Henry. I feel like this is kind of a TSN turning point of the end. If you can make this one, make this double, roll underneath. You're sitting pretty good. Things don't go well here. Hi, yeah, yeah. Could be, could get ugly. Well, and I'd have to check the archives or even maybe check with Bob Sonder who would know better, but I don't know if a team's ever been forced to shake after two ends in an SCT event, but. Uh oh. We the boys are trouble. on it. Go, go, go. Do we get lucky enough to roll into the blue? Yes, we did. And See? it's buried. I don't want to say that was by design, but it looked very, very intentional. Yeah, I think he even gave the little peace sign, like, yep, that's the one. Boys are going to probably try and throw a cap on top of this one. Get that one on the button guarded up. Just hanging right out there. It finishes pretty good, though. Don't be late, Tardy. Get on her good. There it is. Never a doubt. If they can't get this roll underneath, I don't know if this is the right call here. Like I think the right play here is just to throw that little back button, back forward tap. You want to try and make sure you score this in. He's throwing a little more than I uh, was it after. We're, we're tight again. We're tight again. Oh, no. I think we're going to rack. I think we're racking again, guys. Rack of ribs. Uh, I mean, tell me a better situation than as a skip. You're just lobbing in guards. That's why you got a great threesome in front of you. That's right. And he's done it like a genius for 20 years. So what a dream. Boys cleaning up the path, making sure we don't get any picks here. Line looks pretty good out of the hand. I think we're going to place this right on Crosby Hanna. Hello, Crosby. Oh, 
Not as much glide as I thought. That's okay. It's still perfect placement. That's probably going to cost you a beer, AJ, but great try on the Crosby Hannah there. Luckily for me, I have an unlimited tab here at the Highland Curling Club, the greatest curling club north of the tracks here in Regina. I would have to agree. I love this place. It's kind of like a second home. Not that there's anything wrong with the Cali. Dean's over there trying his best. Yeah, they. that's where my banners hang. I got none here. Jeez Louise. If you ask nicely, I'm sure they'd let you take them over here. <laughs> it's because I was good before 2005, and it all was downhill after that. Okay, here we go. Easy, boys. It's got to curl with that kind of weight. Okay, play the back one. Roll it under. Maybe leave yourself the old Hail Mary angle run. It's enough rocks up front to make it happen. Yeah, I don't got a watch out here, but last night we were playing and it was running like 15 seconds. Just dream ice to throw draws on. Just quickly around the rings here. I believe we have Mitch Height up one on sheet one. Bear with me, guys. My eyes aren't what they used to be. Mitch is down one. Like I said, thank God I have Deej here. <laughs> A one Jason Jacobson looks like he's up two in two. Lovable guy. This is tight. This is tight. This is tight. That'll work, though. If they keep brushing it, though, it might. You know what? If you can throw the right weight and get tight to that top guard, I think I think it's there for three. Very tough, but I think it's there. Those are the risks you can take at this point, though. Yeah, oh yeah, down four. I'm laying it all on the line. Chalk me up. All in. I honestly think you don't even got to get that tight to the guard. You got a little bit of space there. Just gotta throw the right weight here and then let the let the boys brush and away you go. If they make this, I hope you guys bet the over on this game. It's long. It comes down a little bit. He's close. The king is never out of it. Yeah, he just overthrew it just a little bit there. Gets the boys on the board. 4-1. Still a chance. It, but sometimes curling just isn't as fun as it can be on the Nintendo Switch. Don't get stuck in your curling club this year. Learn the game inside and out. Play for your favorite country and take the curling world by storm. With up to four players per console, you can enjoy curling with your friends and family anywhere, anytime. Let's play curling. Available now only on Nintendo Switch. Saskatchewan, you know Sastel because we're everywhere. Because being everywhere keeps us connected to you. With Sastel sponsorships, we get to be part of your community. We're here with you and we're here for you. 
it's easy to get started. All you need to do is apply. Sastel cares. Always has, always will. To apply for sponsorship, visit sastel.com slash sponsorships. All right, and we're back. Oh no, it looks like the first guard is sliding into the rings. Not what you want, but you're down 4 1 playing three, but. Yeah, Arnold is shaking his head out there. I'm not sure if it's Arnold or Arnold, but uh, he knows. Slight mistake. With the backwards hat and that flow, he kind of looks like Icebox from Little Giants. <laughs> I'm loving this team. If this was a football game, I'd be all over Team Henry. Mickish wasting no time eliminating that rock. Little Giants, hey, what a great movie. I can't believe I didn't comment on that earlier. One of my favorites growing up, actually. What was the other guy's name? Spike? I think you're right, yeah. I'm not going to lie, a big part of me really wishes that Arnold would have had the eye black on out there on the ice. That would have just <laughs> made my day. Okay, we'll look to find the right way here and get this one set up on the center line. And oh, he likes it. He's setting the, the sliding stick down. He knows. He knows he's got this one locked and loaded. Boys are going to the wing here. Getting aggressive. Dallin would have learned this move from old Stevie Laycock. Pretty sure he was the inventor of going to the wing. But usually when he had one buried. But you never question old Stevie Laycock's quit. He, he knows the game, that man. Never question that fella. It's been around the game a long time. Last year when we had to check vaccinations before everybody could play, he was the only competitor in the field that had the AstraZeneca and not Moderna. So that tells you a little bit about his age. Jeez, these guys are worse than me for hanging up the scores. We try and give you guys an update, but we don't got a whole bunch on a couple of these sheets. I think we have Damon Bernath up two on sheet two over Smith. Don't know much about Team Smith. They're one of our two teams from Manitoba. Couple Tuckers out here. You gotta know they're good guys though. Sponsored by a craft brewery. That's how you know they like to have fun. Corn brooms and bison t-shirts. The boys are here to play. If they were leaving their kids at home before they left for this event, they'd say, bye son. That is my one dad joke of this end. Stay <laughs> tuned for more. I think T 
Team Henry might be learning from their mistakes and keeping things a lot cleaner. The only thing is when you're down three with outs, you really can't just open things up. You got to try and mix, mix in as many rocks as possible and then pray for a haymaker from Holyfield at the end. They might be slow playing it, trying to tire the old guys out. Or maybe they just want to make sure they get a feel for the ice, and then they attack in the back half of the game. You just never Could know. Be. They could be a second-half team. We don't know. Absolutely. Henry's always got a plan. Yeah, we don't got an update on sheet one. It looks like I got one in the first, but I don't have any action. They're in the third end right now. I did misspeak last time. It's Josh Height, my mistake. We have Josh, Mitch, and maybe even Drew out here somewhere. Oh yeah, he's playing third, it looks like, for Josh, so the whole family. Father Brad is in depressed event for the replay of the Masters Provincials, but otherwise I'm sure he'd be in this event too. <laughs> Lucky for us, he's not, so most of our walls will stay intact this weekend. <laughs> We're going to need a few more jokes this end, AJ, because he's... Uh, up and down, run it up and down kind of things. There's not a whole bunch to talk about. Well, I can tell you that uh, my dad has been trying to teach my little nephew Spanish, and so far all he can say is please, which I think is poor before. <laughs> Shout out to the team on sheet one. I'm not sure who it is, but they have pinstripe jerseys. Very much so Yankees vibes over there. And it's uh, it's dazzling. Hey, but the Yanks are down on two. So I guess they get away with it because they can say it's Astros color. So those boys came in here with a plan. If you're not cheating, you're not trying. <laughs> I wish I was Mattress Mac, $10 million on the line because the boys are looking pretty good I guess I gotta say I think we have all the makings of a blank in this end guys Quick heads up to anybody who's considering commentating. Anybody can do it. It is extremely easy, as I'm sure you can see. Knowledge of curling, not relevant. Humor, not relevant. Being present is all that matters, apparently. Have a pulse and a adapter for your iPhone, and you are in. Okay, I see what they did here. They threw it in a little tricky spot just in case you hit this one a little inside on the. And uh, you might jam this one on the back. And then all of a sudden. Uh oh. Here came that free deuce Friday at an oar. Ah, uh, no jam, no jam. Knew, he made sure of that.
I would love to know where this Team Henry is from. Anybody that's watching, if you could put it in the chat, that'd be great. Looks as though Randy Bryden got his due stack on sheet three, so all tied up with them and Jacobson going into three. That's a good battle. A few old veterans that have been around the game for a little while. It's good to see them still out there making shots. Good old blue hoodie Bryden. Don't think I've ever seen him play in anything but that sweater. This thing's got a lot of wins underneath it. Nothing like being a nice skip, open draw, making your boys go post to post. I used to love when that happened to me. Thanks, skipper. You couldn't just lob one in there nice and easy. Now we got to think here. Now we got to think. Let's make the hit, roll this right across, and then make him make him think about what he's doing on his last one. Both Mickish and Tardy getting out of the way of Arnold. Wise move. Clear the path. Oh, this could be nice. Okay. This could be a cross house. Gotta go. Oh. Oh. Geez, you weren't kidding about those dirty shoes, eh? Holy man, what do we got? I know. I think they're suede. I might have to wear those to work tomorrow. Talk about a multi-purpose shoe. No doubt. I'm talking curling. I'm talking weddings. I'm talking first dates. <laughs> The skip stream. Throw it as hard as you can and don't look back. Well done, Dallin. SASTEL Be Kind Online wants to stop cyberbullying. Want in on the action? We award up to $1,000 for youth initiatives that help spread kindness and prevent bullying. What great idea do you have to help stop bullying? SASTEL can help. Go to BeKindOnline.com and apply for a grant today. Together, we can make a difference. Okay, we got the first guard up and up in play on the center line there. So we got some action start. They're gonna want to get more rocks in play to try and uh, give themselves a chance to steal and get uh, tighten up these games here for sure. Dallin looks like he's going to the wing, throwing a little corner guard, and yeah, if we're making shots this end, we should be in for some action.
that's one way of double centers right there. Allen's going to uh, take the wide side, try and wrap things up. And... This one might need some help getting by. And that's what the boys are there. Use your horses. Oh, yeah. And now make her, make her move, and look at that. Bends it like Beckham. Ah, the pinstripe pirates are being skipped by Cody Sutherland. I didn't notice that before. Good guy, that Cody Sutherland. Where are they from, AJ? You know, I don't know. Uh, last year, their jackets were very confusing. The spots are small in the province, so they are from Saskatchewan. That is as much as I can narrow it down. Part okay. of me wants to say Rosetown area. I'd like to find who the designer is of those gear, because, yeah, I'm a fan of those pitch stripes, too. Look at your boys. Well done. We have another rack. No. Another rack brought to you by Sask Pork, major sponsor of Team Myers. <laughs> <laughs> A one Matt Lang over on sheet one. Just dusting off the shoes for this event. The Under Armour sleeves with the polo. He could take a business call or sweep this thing right through the house. He still got it. Look at him scrubbing over there. You know, I lost to Matt Lang probably 42 times in my junior career back when him and Braden Malinsky were playing together. Malowski? Gene. <laughs> they always scared me because they were sponsored by Titleist, and I'm like, what are these golfers doing on the ice? And I found out I seen them hit a seven iron. They can't go, so that's why they're curling. But looked good doing it, I tell you. Oh, yeah. Nice, beautiful blue jacket, Titleist. I'm like, wow, these guys know what they're doing. They're shining out here. Brought to you by Ken Rogers. Yes. And he's hitting four off the tee, and the rest is history. Let's get back to our action here on sheet four, though. And Team Henry. We have another rack. No, this is not Montana's. Unlimited rifts are not on special tonight. Boom. Come on. Someone's got to be kidding me. That's a full rack of ribs tonight, yeah. I can't wait for Ashton Kutcher to pop out and just tell me I'm being punked because this could not be that many racks in a row. You know what? I just, I don't know. Is it the skip maybe not giving it too much ice or are the boys just kind of hooking it and getting a little tight with their releases? Bit of A, bit of B. All I know is ever since I mentioned the Pile of Bones White IPA pints, this team looks like they're trying their best to get up here early. I do not blame them for that. Oh, they're trying to go around now. Go around, tuck around. Oh. How good is that? Yes. He's smirking. He loves it. When you're Team Henry, this look is terrifying. I think they want to play the quad peel here somehow. I think if you rip that top one, I mean, this is why I'm never a skip, but there should they should drag a little bit where maybe it goes back enough to touch a piece of that blue. If it misses it by three feet, that's why I played lead for the last 10 years of my life. 
I feel like this is why you're barely sneaking out wins against Quinn Broda on Thursday night on the early draw. Hey, hey. So I'm back in the skipping position where I belong. Sorry, Deuce. You've been demoted. I like this. Me too. I just hope that he gives her a little extra jam there. Maybe. Yes. Maybe the old Kmart little extra stab. Make sure that uh, she's she's moving here. And I mean, big man, man, has the strength to fire that hack. It's almost like he doesn't want to. I think maybe an old football injury to the hamstring acting up that's causing him to come out of the hack a little slower, but. Yeah, I'm sure if we look close on the hands, they probably got the state championship ring on each one of these guys. I love them all in varsity blues. <laughs> I watched Friday Night Lights last night, so I got excited. Oh, we're a little tight here again. Not again. Oh, and it left the angles just in just a awful. terrible order up front. Yeah, I don't know what to make of this mess here. Dallin's just going to get over the top aggressive. Yeah, like there's really nothing to lose here with those being staggered top guards there. You wrap another one again, they're going to have to waste another shot throwing at those. And then you throw a couple guards up, and I don't know how you score. He's walking himself through it. He's got the. WWLD, what would Lyle do? Lyle knows all, so. If anything, this one's going to end up a little tight around that guard. You don't want to line them up better for them. Oh, no, we're, we're cruising. Oh, oh we got no. a pick. Our first pick of the night. Oh, Brought boys, we got a. chick Construction. We leave our job sites dusty. <laughs> no, that one falls to Jim Garris. He is our resident mop man, and uh, he clearly missed that pass tonight. Okay, he's looking at the angles here. It would be a lot easier if he had a chance to run one of his yellows back, but the angles on those top guards are just no good for him, so he's looking like he's trying to run this blue back. Little high side, maybe get lucky here and get them all moving. With the casual hand in the pocket, he doesn't seem too worried about it. He has no fear. That is extremely tight. We might <laughs> still be playing the yellow. Okay, get, get the tick off the yellow, then the blue. Ta ta. <laughs> ah, I tried. I tried to help you guys out. <laughs> oh. Oh, no, we lost the shooter, too. Um. Team discussion after the game tonight will be, let's maybe take a pinch more ice, be a little more positive with the release, set ourselves up for victory game, too. Maybe even just be a little bit more positive on the ice, you know? Just a little, a couple more smiles, a couple more laughs. That was not my department in my playing days, so but I hope that they, they can figure it out. Is he coming right in right now? And uh, Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Look at this. Also, just a small tidbit. I just realized now that the lead in second, when they stand beside each other, it's Arnold Schwartz. And, I mean, that's just <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> there. There's another great draw there. Yeah, I don't think you could see enough of that. And playing the blue, it's just too late in the end now. Now it's all in. I think you got to run that yellow into the to the crotch of that one there. Give yourself a hope. It's just no. Oof. They're going for it. He's going for the thin the thin blue, eh? I just feel like you can't see a ton of this. And if that yellow comes back and you dead nose that one on the center line, you might not be shot, but you kill two blues. Then you might give yourself another chance there for 
you got to think at some point the curling gods shine down on them and give them a break. I did just see a rail aid come through the ceiling. This that is, is a it. bad sign that our roof is maybe falling apart. <laughs> okay, light. You got to sweep, boys. You got to sweep it. You're getting tight again. I. <laughs> He's close. He's close. Oh. King Henry does it again. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> bow, bow. <laughs> Great throw, Mr. Henry. The sad news is you don't have hammer, and there's still one blue berry in the forefoot, and they're throwing. So. I got to be quite frank, Hank. That was not enough. Another look See, down to sheet three with Randy Bryden. He's still staying in it. You know, Some people said he didn't have what it took at his age, but I said, nay, nay. Randy's never out of the game. I'm pretty sure I run a 2-17 lifetime record against Randy there. It was nice to let him win. Let, let him, him let me win twice, I guess I should say. See, maybe Yo Henry knew what he was doing because he makes this draw now, and then that shot that I want to play last shot, he's going to leave that one for himself right now to get himself right out of trouble. Has he been hustling us, slow playing us? Oh, yes. The ace has talked up his sleeve, I'm sure. But when Dallin does that... Yeah, see, no, I think you get, there's no point in not playing this yellow just off nose right onto the beak of that. You make the double, it sits buried, and then you say, game on, gentlemen. I don't know if that was just a spiteful shot by Dallin. I don't think he liked that the king threw that one through the port so lackadaisically and made the shot because he just welded that one on the front there and didn't even smirk. He is perturbed. Yeah, well, he makes this one, and he'll be telling him, hey, Prince, that's what the king does right there. What are we looking at here, about Three quarters high side? You know, I don't know. Um, man's shoulders are in the way, and as you can tell, they are broad shoulders, probably from carrying this team most of the way through the season, I would imagine. But. He is a man. He's a man. Here we go. Easy. Got to move a little bit. We're curl here. We're close. Come on, boys. I think he's got it. Oh, no. It's Does he? Hey, damage control. Damage control. We're okay. That's right. Some say the goal is to just make sure you play the next end. And I think he's done that. So uh, open draw to the eight foot, full eight foot here for Dallin Myers to go up six to one. His draw weight's been pretty smooth. The smooth criminal out there tonight. I got a good chance he makes this one. Annie, are you okay? I have a feeling he's gonna plunk this one right on the lid. I got a feeling. His line is never off. A lot hey. of laser work up at the Nutana. They're wide here, I gotta say. <laughs> He's playing the chisel. <laughs> okay, we're by the guard now. Oh yeah, nothing like being just a true gentleman skip and throwing it right in the nail on your own. What a beast. That's why you practice by yourself, I guess. You get used to that. That's what perfection looks like, just like your car will look after you take it to Elite Auto Body, where all damages are taken away. Shout out to Corley Brilts and Cindy Metz.
We asked Saskatchewan what they know about 5G. Uh, more speed, more innovation. It's going to make our lives a whole heck of a lot easier. This is what 5G looks like. Better, faster. Sounds like one more G. Sounds pretty good. I don't know what it means. All you really need to know is the future of 5G is here and will continue improving through investments in network technology. And we're starting this end much how we finished the last with precision shots made by Team Myers. I just got back. Team Myers. Kind of looking like me playing lead, throwing that first draw back four. Get the stare from the skip like he wants you off the roster. Seen that before. Too many times. But comes back with a beauty on his second, and he is going to retain his position on the, uh, on the team. Well done. Ooh. Like it's nothing. If you're not living on the edge, you're not living, they say. You know, we got plenty man. of ice here, so if we rack, then I just I don't know what to uh, think anymore. Yeah, I'm getting skipped the dishes. Montana, rack of ribs. I it's think he's me. racking again. No, not I don't today. Know how this is possible. Oh, he's giving up. He's looking back. He's not happy. I think he just kicked our fake ficus plant out there, too. Bernadette McIntyre is not going to be pleased about that one. Yeah, it's where that one ended up, leaving those angles too. Holy Toledo, that's not going to help things. I know the feeling though. You know, you get down, you think it's okay, I'll get the next one, I'll get the next one, and the next one just never comes. You know, you just fall into this, this endless cycle of missed shots and frustration. Also, to big man Arnold, if you listen to this broadcast later, it's all in love, my man. Please don't come punch me in the face. I will put 50 bucks on him, though, in an arm wrestle. I would put 50 bucks on him in an arm wrestle against a silverback. <laughs> Do you remember the machine at the science center that you could arm wrestle? They would be a whole bunch of different animals. Probably designed after Mr. Arnold. Back when he was seven. <laughs> All right, Mr. Schwartz, lining things up. Going to try and throw a little steamer right down the gut. Sometimes when things aren't going well, the best shot you can throw is one right down the center line. Just slide out down the middle and throw it down the middle, but sometimes it doesn't work out. Oh, I just see two yellows going in the corner and blues throwing. Not a sign you want. I just hope Dallin asks if uh, Team Gamble minds if they use their scoreboard once they score too many to keep it on sheet four scoreboard here. Oh. 
Dang. Boys are pounding this one. What team was pounding that? On? Do we have our first? Do we have a hog? Oh, we no. might have a hog rock here. No, nope, he's over. Did he get it over? Oh, my goodness. Yep. Whew. Nicest shoes in the game. He's got some Lamberfitis. That's the reason that it got over the hog line. Sorry, AG, I'm not the best at the team names. Some of these newer teams out here at Sheet 2. Who's the guys that blew it open on Sheet 2? Um, if you know off the top of your head. That would be Damon Bernath. They were uh, they represented Saskatchewan at Nationals, Junior Nationals oh. this year. Okay, and they just stole three in the third end. Well, I guess that was probably last end. Oh, it's handshakes. The boys yeah. are interested in a Pepsi and a box of popcorn. Away we go. Call it a day. That is a 7 nothing win right there. Congratulations to them. Our second 7 nothing win of the day. The first one was from Kelly Knapp and the boys. Wow, a couple touchdowns. Good for them. <laughs> Mark Lang has entered the building. Oh, what a beast. I love that guy. Oof, this looks a little tough, eh? There's not much room on this yellow. You got the gas. I think he coming. has it. I think he chiseled it straight out the side. And I think you're wrong. I meant to say off the side of Dallin's heel, you didn't let me finish, sir. There you go. Now he's corrected himself wisely. Okay, oh. we got some action setting up here for uh, Mr. Henry. The only thing is I wish there was an easier solution to try and set up this next best rock, but no matter if you put it anywhere close to your yellow, it's probably getting blasted out of there again, so... Absolutely can't have it corner froze or it's just no. disaster. And the sad part is there's literally no room for error on this shot. Because if you're missing, you're either ticking the guard or you're leaving it on the corner. And then, yeah, it's it's not going to be good. This has to be precise. At least Shout out got to the... Precise Temperature, our refrigeration experts here at the Highland Curling Club. For all your coolant needs, call Precise Temperature. My ears are getting a little warm in these headphones. Maybe they can cool them down. That's because this commentary is fire. <laughs> Absolute heat. Like we just said. Like Mr. A man. A dart. Mr. Man. Welcome to the conversation for the All-Star Third today. Because that right there is a shot that had no room. Now I'm trying to look up here at the screen to see exactly what we're looking at for angles. But right now, these yellows are sitting Pretty darn good, I must say. I think Dallin just refuses to admit it. He's just going to let Garrett fire a missile at it. Well, he's throwing the same rock he just threw, so you got to hope that he's close. I think his plan was to just throw it much harder this time, so that one was clocked at 113 kilometers an hour. Ooh, Randy Johnson. Okay, that's right, a tough part. That bird. I can't see right now who is shot at the back. There is blue oh, shot there for go. sure. Yeah. Okay, so you get. I mean, you lob one in there to freeze that blue, but the tough part is where. When are you gonna? You don't got many rocks to try and get at that one after this, though. Top button here, and then we'll see what happens. See if the man's got the touch. Back to back jacks. Not a good sign when the boys are walking beside it. No one's scrubbing. And they don't even look like they're thinking about scrubbing. Oh, little action late. Okay. Freeze the back one. 
Not awful. We're sticking around at least. That's hey. that was the error in the first few ends. We're sitting two three. We're second and third. I can see what he's trying to eye up with this little angle run here. Yellow, yellow, blue. A lot of discussion. Longest shot call of the day. I wouldn't say it's nerves. I think Dallin just knows. you got to make the right decision here. It might give uh, Team Henry the hope they've been looking for. Well, I'm trying to look at the angles, and I can't see him great right now, but I'm just wondering if he comes down to this back yellow, does he leave that easy kind of crotch in off double? And then that's probably what he's looking at because might even get a little action where it spins up a little bit. And then he's like, oh, geez, could give up three. More discussion from the front end down here. Dustin Mickish acting like he's Ben Hebert and taking over the conversation. You don't want to do that. Poor Ben Hebert. Looks like he took his helmet off too soon in space with those eyes. <laughs> Mine are pretty similar, so thanks for bringing that up. <laughs> Sorry about that, Buzz. What's on tap? Space Cadet? Yeah, sounds all right. <laughs> Sign me up. I got to go to the screen for this one. It's too tough to see. Oh, we rock. Okay, like this, this shot's going to probably sound a little insane to any of the viewers at home right now, but let's hear it. You almost have to play your yellow yellow right now and just anything that comes back on this blue is going to end bad so if you can play that yellow yellow and then hope that you get a miss out of Dallin you just never know yeah oh Henry's taking a look at it right now that's it buddy you found it that's your only chance you got to get a miss regardless but this is your Get it a jail free card if you can get a if you can make this one and Dallin and Dallin can uh, come up on the wrong side of the of the rock I guess I'll say today. We'd love to show you on the telestrator, but much like everything in the Highland, it doesn't work. Get back on this side of the sheet, Mr. Henry, and have a look at this yellow yellow because that's the answer. The nice thing about these SCT events is we don't play with clocks. That being said, it's not their fault that every sheet around them has just been an absolute sweeping. No pun intended. No puns intended. Maybe they should get the man sweeping this one just in case. Because if you got the man sweeping it, you're probably getting by the guard. We're not going to be taking any guards anymore. Arnold does look gassed, but he is timing every rock, which I do appreciate. Yeah, even if it is peel weight. You got to go. You got to go. Get in there, Schwarzenegger. He's there. Oh, uh, no. It's never good. Okay, he's setting himself up for one last shot at glory on the last one. He should have something one way or another to make. He can't cover both angles here, so he's going to have a chance at coming in quiet weights uh, with the intern or the one I wish he would have played last shot, the uh, out turn bang bang on yellow yellow. The Compton run back, bang bang. Oh no, Jason Jacobson tries to blank on three and he dead nuts it and he is sickened, absolutely sickened. He went whiter than the sheet. The battle of the vets is all tied up going into five. 
as you should expect. My apologies. Going into six. They're playing nine regardless. Keep All right, down, Duke, looks what do like you got? Trying, yeah, the Dukes there looks like he's going to try and lob one in there and just come down to that back yellow, I believe. Uh, sit one, two. And then we'll see what, uh, yeah. Oh, and it's like it's nothing to him. Like it's nothing to him. Yeah, that's pretty darn good. It looks like it might. He angles just refuses here. to let his boys do any of the work, hey? He just says, no, you guys take the day off. They look at it fast, and right now, you know what? He's probably right here. If he could just get by that yellow with a bullet right now, you kill both those blues. Uh, you're making them throw against two? Yeah, against two there. Oh, this is last rock. Sorry, this is for two then. Oh, yeah, I love this. This is there, I believe. Quarter rock on the top blue. Kills them both. We got ourselves a 6-3 game. Field goals all around, Jackie. You know, if Garrett Springer could throw a better rock, we wouldn't always be in this position, but every time we look over, there's another chance for Henry. <laughs> oh, we got to go. We got to go, uh -oh. boys. He uh -oh. might get lucky and have... Oh, no, he is not ever lucky. It's just, That's big trouble. Yeah, steal a two is probably uh, Velcro in my world here. I'd force my skip to shake. I would have already done it. And I've actually seen you do it. You don't agree oh, with yeah. the call to continue playing, and you just walk off. Yeah, you, con you have a conversation about it in the change room after. Why did you shake? Uh, because it was 6-1. Oh, boy. The Roaring Game. We all love it, but sometimes curling just isn't as fun as it can be on the Nintendo Switch. Don't get stuck in your curling club this year. Learn the game inside and out. Play for your favorite country and take the curling world by storm. With up to four players per console, you can enjoy curling with your friends and family anywhere, anytime. Let's play curling. Available now only on Nintendo Switch. We asked Saskatchewan what they know about 5G. Uh, more speed, more innovation. It's gonna make our lives a whole heck of a lot easier. This is what 5G looks like. Better, faster. Sounds like one more G, sounds pretty good. I don't know what it means. All you really need to know is the future of 5G is here and will continue improving through investments in network technology. We are playing an end we didn't think was going to happen after the result of the last end, but here we are nonetheless. I don't know what those brooms are made out of, but the fact that they bend like that and don't snap is simply astounding. The same thing that Lieutenant Dan's legs were made out of. Oh, I love Lieutenant Dan. Bubba Gum Shrimp. You can Eight make one. it. I'm going to be honest here. I The look that I would be giving my skip for us still on the ice is not a good one. The good news is at least it was the 9 o'clock draw, and they're going to be super tired tomorrow. Yeah, I, I mean, did they look at the draw? What are the chances? There's a chance they probably played 9 a.m. I'd be like, hey, boss, listen, we got to accept defeat, and we bounce back tomorrow. You going to keep me up till midnight? 
I might go to the casino then. Even Stevens. I don't know. Dangerous. I like to live dangerously. Okay, we got double corners going up, which uh, the hope is to probably get six to set, get back to within one. You'll have to make every rock count after this one. I have a really hard time getting a read on King Henry. He's always got the glove hand in his pocket, so is he mad? Is he just content? Does he have poor circulation and always want to keep his hands warm? I don't understand. I'm getting a vibe like the over-under was six and a half ends on this game, and he bet the over. He's a betting man like myself, so I got a feeling he took the over, and he's going to ride this thing out all eight. If his team's going to lose, he's going to pocket some dough. I don't know if we've ever had to hit the buzzer on a team in an SCT event, but today's the day. Oh, the boys are working to get this one over the line. All right. Mr. Shiny Shoes has done it again. Well done. With his chocolate dip cone shoe. Yeah, oof. Milky Way closes for the season. Out comes Tardy at the Highland. I will bet you $20 we rack again. Oof. I'll take it, actually. I only got 10 bucks in my pocket, so there's a chance I need this to not rack. Take a little more ice there, Mr. Henry. I know his broom's practically on sheet five, but I still think. I need you to sweep now, man. You got to start now. Don't. What are you doing? It's starting to move on me. I need you to go. There you go. Yeah, dig in. Dig in. All right. Well, just like that, the Highland Curling Club owes DJ Kidby $20. Our last $20, in fact. And McDonald's is going to gain another client with a McChicken meal on the way home. Woo -woo. <laughs> as long as you pick up that uh, bacon and egg. -er. Yes. That we do need. Having uh, Mr. Arnold and Mr. <laughs> Schwarzenegger, we could have it all today. Tomorrow morning, we'll see you guys here bright and early. If this is any good, the king might be in trouble. I don't think they expected to get dethroned game one, but here we are. Yeah, here we are. Oh, boy. I do understand how this team, Henry, came together now, though, with, with seeing the last names at the front end. Arno Schwartzen. Yeah. I will get the boys bacon and egger in the morning, and then we got team Arnold Schwarzenegger ready to roll. I love it. Are you good at curling? No. Do you have hilarious names when combined? Yes. <laughs> That's... I think that's half the reason why I made half of my team. So you just go with it. You just go with it. Make it fun. It's supposed to be fun, right? Sports? Okay, this is a tough little port to get through. We're playing a little tap. Roll behind the corner, maybe? Has absolute peel weight. Well, that's not the ideal weight you want. But you want to punch this blue out into the, into the open here and roll that one around the corner. It actually Arnold is ready, though. He's close. He's close. Okay, that Textbook. one sits. Textbook. Sit. Punch it Yellow open. Yellow oh. under cover. Oh, and look at the God. blues. You leave yourself a crotch Schwartz. double. Welcome to Regina, gentlemen. That was a shot you needed in the first end, though. Here's hoping they score one this end and continue to play. If they score one and continue to play, I will have to sign off. We are working with 14% battery life here, so... Yeah, I'm sitting at 12. It's been a slice, but yes, 
getting down to the nitty gritty. All right, you're going to want to take away this angle so you can't give up this auto double here. But you don't want this to over curl. You, you'd rather probably crash the it top is. guard than get by it. That's probably I best. Because if it, if it just gets by, that's the worst case scenario. That that's was actually, right. yeah, that's better. That's better than just getting by that top loop. Um, I feel like Henry tries to run this back. And he somehow gets so unlucky, he runs it straight through the port. Yes. Oh, he's calling the shot. And, geez, you've been right one out of a hundred. So I feel like this could be that set. If there's a hole here, the man will find it. Got to go. <laughs> Shockingly, we're tight a little bit again. I think we're racking somehow. No. Oh, okay. no, that's the man to sit three. That's worst case Ontario right there. Yeah, that little even with double. Arnold carving it, it didn't work. <laughs> that uh, yeah, that auto double is now history, and we're in some deep, deep. I can't even say the word. It's not good though. It's not good. It's okay. it's A lot of blueberries in the house right now. About to be another, I think. Yes. We're going to need the taxi of yellows to start to come flying in. Over the speed limit, bring everything you got, and see how many of these blueberries... Okay, let's see. What can we do for an angle here? Do we think Kirk was the more loved brother, and that's why Dallin is so aggressively just burying this team? Oh yeah, he's out for blood. Yeah. You can either hit the very, you can hit the outside of that top blue right now with absolute peel weight, and three should go. Or you try and hit the one in the middle. With a little roll and then give yourself a chance on the on your next few. Either way, it's the Titanic. It's a sinking ship going right now. Oh boy. Okay, he's a little wide, so you may as well sweep it. I would sweep it right now, boys. Keep sweeping. Because if you sweep it, you might get the outside, you might get luckier. Honestly, okay. best case. I'll take it. Double board, chuck it up, ding! <laughs> Dallin doing what he does best, just lobbing a nice guard. Sorry, Dallin, I shouldn't be grilling you like that. I'm sure you're making these run backs and doubles like an all-star skip. I just know you got these, uh, these guards that come around down to its science. Dallin is a numbers guy. You know, you see him calculating the percentage of shots, looking like Zach Galifianakis in the hangover. The numbers behind his head, that's Dallin for you. All right. <laughs> the Zach Galifianakis. I think I was the Bradley Cooper, that's why you had to boot me off the roster after juniors. Okay, here we are. We're coming in hot. Weight looks okay. I feel like we're uh, tight guard right now. Line looks pretty good. Keep the brooms down. This is the worst time for yeah. a pick. Just dust her down, fellas. Life's good. I see this angle run coming in for three, the sit three. <laughs> Maybe this way. No, I don't think we, I don't like the tap. I don't like the tap at all. I like bringing the yellow one of the, I like bringing that top guard in. At least if you sit two, three, four, you're going to make the, you're going to make down, think a little bit on his last one. Right now with blue sitting uh, sitting two, 
We are in a deep pile of shite. What do I know? Only played in the Briar and won a World Junior Championship. Was made famous in Red Deer in 2018. Yeah. They sold a few more Coronas that year. One might say it caused a pandemic. <laughs> 2.0, Team Rona. Okay, if he makes his tap, I think it, I mean, if you make it perfect, it's probably not horrible, but the odds of ever scoring more than one are probably pretty doubtful. But I hope the boys make her. Don't be tight to the guard. We've ticked, we've ticked enough guards today for the whole weekend. Ryan looks pretty good. Give it, need a little bit, boys. You gotta push it far enough. Ah. That's when I would have been fired as a sweeper. But then Arnold does the hair toss like Lizzo. God, he's good looking. Yeah, I could not give him the gears. I'd be like, you know what? Hey, you did well. Let's go arm wrestle someone upstairs for 50 bucks. Anybody want a peanut? <laughs> it cannot be confirmed, but I'm sure the team has not paid for a beer yet upstairs, as he will arm wrestle anyone in the room for the full tab. And that is one of the main sponsors of Team Henry, I'm sure. Because I would not, not want to go down that road with that gentleman. Here comes Dicey Dallin. When I say Dicey, I mean smooth and Dicey. Are we worried about line? We do. We want to hold this one out. We want to keep this one as straight as we can right now because it is getting a little tight. If it's passing off, passing off. Yeah, I might abandon ship right now just so it doesn't chop off too far. No, nope, oh. just kidding. He knew what it's he was really doing. Not, oh, takes off at the end. Okay, so you're playing this top yellow in. This is the only play. This, If he calls any other shot, usually I there's a chance that I'm wrong. 3% ah, chance. But this time I'm 100% right. You have to play your top yellow, angle run back. That's, you're probably not going to stick your shooter, but you can get three. Other than that, it's Velcro. Good night, Jim Kite. We'll see you guys in the morning. All right, Mr. Henry's taking a look at it. Love there this. There we go. If he makes this, Coronas go on special for the next three hours. This shot brought to you by Team Henry's only sponsor, Northern Lights Eye Care. The eye of the tiger is going to need to happen to make this one happen. This is not easy. They're going to go nuts when he hits this. Oh. Got to curl a little bit. Oh, no. Looks like that's probably it for the boys. Surprisingly, we have shakes. We have handshakes. Hell of a fight by Team Henry. Hoping for the best for them for the remainder of this event. Dallin Myers advances to 1-0. and Yeah, great game for Team Myers to start things off, get themselves in the win column right off the bat. Um, Team Henry looking to uh, yeah, jump back in that column tomorrow. Thanks a lot, guys. That was a lot of fun. We might even see you tomorrow. Who knows? From Signing AJ off. and DJ, have a good night. Ciao.
Saskatchewan, you know SaskTel because we're everywhere. Because being everywhere keeps us connected to you. With SaskTel sponsorships, we get to be part of your community. We're here with you and we're here for you. It's easy to get started. All you need to do is apply. SaskTel cares. Always has, always will. To apply for sponsorship, visit sastel.com slash sponsorships. 